Hello and welcome back to a inflatable comparison review. What are we comparing? Uh, knockoff inflatable LED scarecrow from I don't even know. What it says Big Life right on the screen. That's on the tag. Yeah. Not from, uh, not from which store it's from. They're both from Big Life. There's pumpkin uh, versus Jemmy Pumpkin Reaper. Who wins? We know Winter Wonderland, uh, that other company that makes inflatables for Christmas at Big Lots, is actually not that bad. Them, like, air characters are actually pretty cool. Air flows is a little bit more. I don't know. I don't like them as much. But anyways, as you can see, there's the boxes. And uh, which one should we open first? Well, this one's listed as 48 inches as opposed to 48. Which one should we open first? Whichever one you want. Fine. Let's open the Jemmy. The Let's have the reaper. Jemmy pumpkin. What? Why is your cord sticking out? Where's your bag, buddy boils? Where is your bag, buddy? I'm doing a terrible job. What the Holy hell? Holy Jesus. Um, I don't think you got a new one, buddy. There's, uh, it's only got Fuck. three, it's got three, uh, metal stakes and it's got what looks to be used. So I us hope this thing actually turns on. Wow, don't, funny. Don't pull on the cord. So uh, this is what happens when you uh, don't pay attention to what you're purchasing because it's the last one. Works. Oh, that's good. Although you can listen to that fan and you can tell it's kind of... That's how it was, small she can't sound, buddy. What? It's on. Does it have any, it's LED, does so it have any dirt on it? No. So maybe it was just... A store display, maybe? Well, if it was a store display, they didn't use it very long because that LED is pretty bright. Well, well, uh, I guess works. we didn't get totally fucked. Oh. Anyways, uh, now the Scarecrow experience. Let's see if we have, there's a bag inside this one, given the last one. Oh, there there's, is, and yeah. it's still clear. That's a weird plastic bag. That still looks like it's in a pillow bag. That's the weirdest looking inflatable it's like it's tape it's tape shut. together. Well, at least they're trying to make it quality for $35. This is, this is kind of different. It's a really cool fabric you don't see it on is Jemmy's. Cool fabric. I don't know. Jemmy does, it have a, does there an instruction book? There right? is. Let's, but before we get into that, here's the steak pack. Oh, yeah, you can tell this isn't Jemmy. They stole the old Jemmy steaks. It's got a little bit of plastic steak. <laughs> they, they're using the old, something close to the old Jemmy steaks bit thinner of a head, so that's not as good. And it's got that tether. Oh, crud, I showed enough of the car if you would see that the car is still not working. Maybe because it's filmed on the same day. And then we have instructions. I'm very curious. Let's see. Christmas polyester blow-up figure. Really? That's when you know you really? have a high-quality product. <laughs> because this Christmas. is in the Halloween sales section and doesn't look very Christmassy. It's holding a fucking pumpkin. <laughs> Christmas polyester blow up figure. <laughs> That's actually funny. Important safety information. This yes. is a season. He's reading the safety season. Seasonal stuff, decoration. Do not use for more than 90 days. Well, I can't wait to break we that. Don't, we don't usually use it more than 90 days. Not for Halloween. Even for Christmas, it's not up to 90 days. It's usually up to about 60 at the most. Oh, gee. Do not mount or place near electric heaters, fireplaces, candles, mm. or sources. Probably like. good advice. Don't put your colossals next you to the hot actually, air vent to the dry You air actually air. read the part of the instructions. This is, I'm, ladies and gentlemen, write this date down. I, I had to make sure it's not like this product will blow up. Usually he just takes those instructions and eats them in the oh, trash. Oh, there's, there's a photo on you it. You didn't get the book and at the same time because you were so worried. But this is a comparison. Because you were worried the other one didn't work. This is a, a comparison. It's an experience. I just got dirt all over it. Alrighty, well, don't break the adapter by slamming it on the ground. Uh, what company is it that uses this adapter? I know we have a bunch of them. Doesn't say. Ching ching. Alright, well, let's inflate this bad boy and see how it does. We got this whole made in child. Ch ch made by ch ch children in China. Oh, uh, let's go. <laughs> One hour later, the, the lights light up. It's also got a small. Oh, I hate these fans. And I already. What got do you hate about the fan? So, A, that likes covering it, which is not good. Why do they do that? I'm a, maybe we should cut that off because it's like literally. 
That one is completely, it's like covering half the fan. So this is the first thing you're going to want to do for your product, is uh, cut this one off. There, that's that one. That one's not, it's cut not on it. that one off. Don't cut it that high. Oh, it's fine. Oh, you're right, it isn't fine. You want to trim that one off too, then just to be safe. No, not that one. Yeah, no, they both look okay. Yeah, I'd leave them. Yeah. So you're going to want to cut those off. We're already destroying the product. That's how far you that. Um, that's that's because you want you want the inflatable to get good airflow and longevity. But look at that. That's nice. I, you know that face is quite bright. What's that you got up there? I is that a bird? There's a bird though. You didn't believe me when I said there's a bird That's a small little in added additional inflatable. Actually, actually, I think there's take, something that's smaller. It's like five inches. Actually, I think there's something that's smaller. Well, yeah, but that's actually... It's, like it's a, pretty tiny. It's, a, it's, it's like an additional thing. I mean, this obviously, the pumpkin... This is not that bad. I actually quite enjoy the design of this. This is one thing people underestimate. They don't like um, non-gemmy like, things for some odd reason. I don't never. I um, never fully understand why. These are both nice. I mean, this but purple that, and very, green. Oh, you know what? I just realized we haven't Scarecrow. done for the last two reviews. I know we said about puffy test. This is not a puffy test. That's it's very puffy, though. Oh, this isn't that much better. At least its main body is a little better. But anyways. Go with some quick fire details. So start off the scarecrow because there's a lot more. Got a nice big black scarecrow hat, wish hat, orange yeah. trim. Uh, little Birdo with big eyes and an orange little beak and two orange. little feathers. And it has orange hair. A detail, it's got a detail. You know what face. this reminds me of? Mm, the that scarecrow? older scarecrow that we had? Mm, I guess. Remember it from what was that? Oh, yeah. The fact it's holding Being a locked? pumpkin though makes it All look these? more like. Halloween and less like fall. Yeah, the other one was a Thanksgiving. And it was around the size too, maybe a little bigger. Wait, is that bird it's supposed to be a turkey on the top? No. Oh. Turkeys aren't fucking black. Well, well I was only saying it that way because I was saying maybe it's a crossover. It looks like a crow. Like maybe it's a crossover. It looks more like a crow. That face is really reminiscent of that inflatable. Uh, pretty cool design. Uh, Jemmy, you, you, I mean, the face is on the other guy is pretty cool. But uh, look, you can see that awesome little polyester fabric thing. So you got your brown trim. You know his, are you talking about his shirt? The design yeah. of his shirt? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. He's got like a plaited shirt. Underneath. Yeah, the plaid shirt. Yeah, there we go. Pretty cool. And he's got little black gloves with the little, I guess that's hay? That's the straw sticking yeah, out of his. straw, hay, straw. Pumpkin, that's actually a little bit cutesy. The whole thing's cutesy. Of what? <laughs> this thing uh, probably shouldn't be $45. I will say that immediately. Are you trying to say it should be 70 no. Oh, what are you trying to say? It should be, it should be less. Oh, uh, okay. Anyways, uh, then we have the black boots and then the purple strap thing that looks overall. Something about it looks off with his buttons. I'm not sure. And then moving to our Jemmy guy. Yeah. He's got a really nice pumpkin face. That one's cool. Put that one on a big... Put that face on a bigger pumpkin reaper. will be pretty good. He's got little green hands for some reason. I don't quite understand. He's got a little orange fabric around the waist and of course... Got like this purple cloak around that little body. That's green, I thought. That is a yellow body. Looks green to me. You're oh well. Colorblind. You need to turn the lights off to see and how they look. Yellow off. All right, right, here comes your lighting test. Lights off. Oh. The scarecrow has good lighting. I mean, it's only the two oh, LEDs. It's, it's just two lights, but it, it's pretty good lighting. Are they LED? LED. They do look They also got LED. They look LED. LED's just selling their lights to everyone. Uh, the pumpkin's very bright. The head's very bright. The torso is. The overall boots, not really. Uh, that guy, he's not so good. The chubby little reefer. He's got one in the head. Yeah. Kind of a little poor, but that's like a re-release design everyone's seen. So. so which one are we rating first? Let's get this shown. Uh, so let's do the pumpkin scarecrow because he's going to be pretty. Not the pumpkin, pumpkin scarecrow? The pumpkin reefer. He's going to be pretty boring. Reaper design. He looks like a ten or twelve foot reaper, only he's four foot tall Which or three and a half foot tall. Isn't cool. So I'd he just look. looks like a tiny miniature, one of the big ones. So I think that if you had like a twelve footer next, and then you had one of these on the side, like kind of like it's his child, <laughs> it would actually look kind of cool. 
But being by itself, I don't know. I mean... You'd have to find, like, the bigger version. Yeah, I I don't like it by itself. It looks like you're missing something. It's pretty small. And there's not much going on. It's not themed. Um, I'd give it a design of, like, a six. Six here? Well, it's designed the same as a big one. It's just miniature. I'm not sure why. The only reason I picked this is because the ghost is way too cutesy. And then the uh, duo pumpkin sack we already have. And then the other one we already have being that, like, pumpkin boy. I don't so this was the only original one, but I actually kind of uh, don't admire this design. It gets, like, a full of kind yeah. of boring. I think full face, that's it. I thought you picked it up just because it was the last one they had to school. Oh, it was the last one. And it's different, you know. And you don't have one yet. Yeah. So. Anyway, so, so you give it a what? Did you say a four? Yeah. Wow. All right. I'm going to say sure four. Lighting, plug, there's plug, two. Plug, is there one or two? I think I see one. a second. There's not another one. There's not a light bulb underneath them? No. Oh, you're right. It's the one. It's that, that one little LED right there. I think it's just like two cutesy or small. One light, but it's LED. You so know what? It gets the doubling effect. So that gives them a two. You know what, Rob? My design would probably go up to a five or a six if these were orange. That's how all put in the green hands are. I don't mind the green hands, but in any I'd case, be orange. oh, I see what you mean though. Because if it's orange, if its head is orange, I, I don't those know. Those arms would be. They look a lot more. Fluid. Anyways, like so because so he's fun. got one one color ruins it. One, and it's my green. favorite lime green. Why color. is he got a hunched back? That was so my cool. favorite lime green Anyways, color cannot one, see. He's got one LED light. I'm wondering what this guy has. We'll get to him in a minute. Uh, LEDs. All right, anyways, he's one LED light, so he gets a two. So that gives me a total of eight. Where are you at? You need to really fix your lighting scale. I love my lighting scale. Don't tell me to your fix it. Your lighting that. scale kind of sucks. But the more lights they put on it, the better the score they get. three is pretty fair because that one LED is not lighting up much. No. Two-thirds of the torso is gone, and the arms aren't lit up or fucking fuck. So, yeah, that gets like a two, three. All right, well, where am I at? Like a seven? You're at a four and a three, so it's seven. I'm at eight. Don't after worry, two, after after two digs. Don't worry, I'll get some points. Up next is attention grabber factor. You know what? I'll start up three. Just because it's a cool face. I know, but if you're a child, a little kid this height. Honest to God, I'm going to be looking at, after that, the 12 footer and being a lot more scared than this one. No, I mean, if you had a 12 footer look like this, it'd be scored a little better, but. I think attention grabber, I mean, it's got the little orange waist thing, and it's green and purple, so it looks very Halloween yeah, colors. colors. I also I'd give Fresh it, I would green. think, I think Not I'd green. give it a four for, for attention grabber. serious? Okay, that's not much more so than yours. Much more thing. Well, I usually give like a seven or eight, so four is a really low four. I know. Anyway, so. So, so what are we at? Uh, I'm at 12. I'm at 10. You're 10. Don't worry, we'll get some points. Because up next is value. What, so, what was the. What's 17 divided by two? $8.50? Was it 17 to begin with? Yes. I don't think that's correct. I think it is. Maybe it was 19. No, yeah, it was 19. Oh, shit. We paid, it was 19, we paid basically just under 10. It was like nine seventy. So anyway, so Hold nine, half off. so nine and a half That's bucks. A lot easier. Nine, nine and a half bucks, uh, just under ten bucks. But with tax, I thought it was just over ten. So basically, we we'll call it ten bucks. So ten bucks, and you get this cute little inflatable. It is better it's than really affordable. Same price as an air doorable at full price. So you know what? Be generous. I'm gonna I think those air doorables are more than ten. Yeah, they are. They're like twelve, like fifteen. Or whatever. Anyways, for ten I'm bucks, gonna... I would say. Um, I would give it, I mean, that's so cheap. I like it when it's cheap. Yeah. I'm going to give it bonus points. I'm going to give it eight. The little cheap fans being like half off are such a score. And when they're $2.20 I mean, for some reason, I love clean. You're right. This is, this is, and you can use this multiple years in a row. It's cheaper than a lot of the pumpkins, like actual pumpkins you carve. And yet it's Oh bigger. my God. So you're right. Store and the pumpkins are like six, seven, This eight thing bucks. gets like an eight. I mean, this is eight. where it's points so at. I'm it's at a good 20. deal. That's why I got it. Yep, so I'm at just an eight. So I scored a twenty overall, and if you're at eight plus your ten. your tens, you're at eighteen. See, it, this it, has got to be our your lowest win that we've ever won. No, other than the one that we didn't really score, so it didn't work. Oh yeah, that one got like a zero. Did we do that? Except for lighting, way? because that lights actually work. Oh, that's the lowest. That's the one that didn't fucking work. We we did end up returning that without any issue, got our money back, but. 
still um, not working inflatable kind of stuff. Anyways, let's move on to the much more cool arc. I always so liked 20. it when it first came out, despite it being not Jemmy. All right. Because I'm not biased towards Jemmy. What Such are we doing here? A scare? Is this a scarecrow? This is the scarecrow with bird and pumpkin. All right. So what's first? Design? I think it's... Well, so this awesome. one has a lot of intricate detail designing. Not only does it have Four this, feet. Not only does it have the little birdo up top that Ben is obsessed with, but he's got a hat with Wait an orange stripe. He's got hair. Something it's that's got, adding up. Here. It's got nice little hold up, hold hair. up, hold up, hold up. Boy. That's supposed to be three and a half feet. That's supposed to be four feet. Yeah. Someone's it's lying. Shorter. That was taller. Yeah, not by much. It goes. You're gonna. You got to go by the tip of the hat. Yeah. You put the hair. No, 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 right in, right in. Go straight across, don't cheat. Yeah, they're like six inch difference. No, you're you're squeezing it as you go together. Look, this see the hat is taller. Like that? It's about six inch difference. Okay, fine. It doesn't look like much of a difference. Look, when you're from this side, Ben can't even see that little one, oh, so okay. yeah. Well, just basically your angle. But anyways, I'll get him back out of the screen. Anyway. There he is. So like I was saying, he's got this hat with the orange brim. He's got the um, hair, like, that goes all the way around the head. Even the back side has some. I mean, it's a little bit more plain, but he's got the hair on the back. You see the bird's back. Oh, it's oh got God. the shirt that goes all the way around the back, and it's got the little straw up on the bottom of its ankles. His little hands have little straw sticking out as well. It's holding a pumpkin with a face. It's got a lot of good detail. And even though it's a small one, it's got the detail you'd expect in a bigger one. I think it does. I like the design. And it's, I actually kind of like the uniqueness of how it is actually kind of cute. So, did we not right go here. over the tethers? No, I don't think we did. There's you know two what? tethers on that Those one. ones are a little higher. This one, um, I'm guessing, yeah, they're right underneath this arm. There's one, and there's one. So, and there's the birdo. Up front, row up close, birdo. Ah, quit biting me, birdo. Just kidding. I know. I know. I am so Anyways, um, I'm giving it an, an, a nine for design. Ugh. It's not big, but it's well designed. Oh, I don't like uh, I don't like this. I can't get a happy score. So, in theory, I should pay off three points, but that's not fair because the rest of that hard carries. So, I guess eight to balance it. So, uh, you had to fix an immediate problem out of the box on every copy. So, you definitely want to cut those two off. They're covering the fan. That's terrible. I already you, forgot about that. You have to cut that off. Minus, I guess, two. And then it's got the not jumpy and cheap fan that's kind of small. And most of them suck. And, yeah. I don't know. I mean, it's a good design. It's fan system. You could use a jumpy in it. You feel me? Yes. I hear you. What's your score? I give an 8. What did you give it? I give an 8. But I'll give it plus 1 because the rest of the design goes very hard. So you're minus pressure. 3 for the, the, the stuff you had to cut off the back and then, pl and then plus 1 for the extra bonus stuff. No, okay, minus I guess. 2 for the thing on the back. Minus 1 because the fan system is... Then that puts you at a 7. Where are you at? Are but you I at give that bonus points, overriding bonus points for oh, the Just give it a number. Are you at 8? Eight? Eight? Fine, we're both at 8. Lighting, um, I've said that like three two times. LED lights, one in the face, which actually works pretty well. Plus, and one in the pumpkin, and they are bright. Plus, these LED lights don't burn out as fast. They are bright, but my rule two times, and I'll give him the bonus times two, so they, he gets a four for his lighting. You're ridiculous. I'd be happy I didn't give it a three. Last time I did 50%. So, uh, yeah, get like a six. Not, oh, maybe, yeah, six. See, the bird out, not very well lit. Your arm's not very well lit. Everything below the That pumpkin, bird is has not zero, very well lit. The bird has zero light. It's, it's got a little bird. bit of an echo in the body. Okay, a few seconds. Anyway, so I'm at four. What number are you at? I said six. So you're at 14, I'm at 12. Attention grabber. This isn't like grabbing your attention. This thing grabs my attention because it's so unique. How many I mean, scarecrows? it definitely looks different. Definitely How many cool. scarecrows? And... And what grabs attention more than a birdo sitting on top of somebody? I know. Who doesn't love birdos? And it's got a bright pumpkin and a bright face. The face really does work well. I, I think this... I think this is high quality. I think this is a knockoff you should check out, especially if you have a small section of your display. This... If you don't put up barely any inflatables, I think this is... And you 
if you say only put up like five inflatables and space them out along your launch bed or something, and uh, you can't go anything above six feet. I'd include this one this year just because it's so or unique. Or if you're having an inside party and you want to use Ooh. an inflatable. This, this one also works. Really, this is a nice inflatable. It is, and it's actually, it's being that it's four feet tall, you probably could get the squeeze on a tabletop without, you know, running out of space at the, on the ceiling. I know. So, I, I, in all honesty, I think this is a really, really nice inflatable. I like it. I think it's pretty cool. I, I do too. I'm surprised. When I just looked at the box, I was like, why are you buying this piece of garbage? <laughs> um, but then, See, now that I did, really helped you. Yeah, I like it. It's pretty cool. It surprised me. You'd be this surprised. Non jummies, pretty cool. Wow. Yeah, that other one didn't surprise me. It was, it was like, well, whatever. <laughs> this one surprisingly is pretty cool. I, worse and the worse face works that's really worse. well. That, that not did I give it a grade yet for its attention? No. I'm fine. I'm gonna go with a. I'm gonna go with a ten. I like it. I really grab Tell you what, it. just because the balance of so many factors, it gets a five. A Jesus. ten. For a four footer, you must be fucking high on something. I need what you're doing. Well, yeah, but not everything can be twenty foot tall. Not everything's going to be six foot tall and animated. And well, I'm not going to punish. I'm not going to punish you being little because some people appreciate the smallness. Hey, I'm actually giving it, taking away points and giving it points for being little. Because out of all your little collections, this one's going to stand out. Or a collection of little labels, this one stands out really well. Uh, like it's up good, cool. high quality. Uh, that plaid shirt gets your attention. It's different and a burdo. So you know, five. But uh, again, it's not licensed. Very small, not animated. Yeah. No special lighting features. Well, we already it's lighting, have some help. But lighting's a separate score. Anyways, moving on. No. Well, I'm at, so I'm at, I'm at twenty two. What am I at? What'd you give it? You so gave it a five. An eight, then a six, then a five. Ooh. Nineteen. All right, you're 19, I'm at 10. already a path out once that one to go. I'm at 22 or 19. So Anyways, what are we rating this on? How value? much for? What, yeah, I think what you bought 35, it. hell would be coming. 17, not as bad. Well, given that right now people can go to the store and buy it for give or take yeah. 40, 50 Our store's like a couple of these. So I would have to say let's go with that score for now because we got it kind of late in the game. And, uh, we'll still put it up. People want to buy, you're going to go buy Once we have the fog machines going, we'll have to make another robo bin just to have all the new stuff we've already gotten for clearance seats and being built up. I know. It means I got to go back out and put up more inflatables. This kind of stuff. <laughs> and then Christmas is coming. Actually, you go to the AM nights. I have to, I gotta work on the broken car that won't start. You work on the inflatables. That's what we'll do. Stop. Anyway, no, value. Um, how much did we how much did we pay for about seventeen eighteen? Hey, it's all it's almost winter time. Nothing doesn't get driven that much. All right, for seventeen eighteen, I feel it's quite good. And uh, pretty soon you'll have, we'll have to drive all the time. Pretty soon. No. You know, when you start driving. No. Oh, for school I'll probably just ride with you still, so we don't it takes up much. Bus yeah, oh, I like. Okay. Me and my bus driver are friends. Yeah, but they're not gonna like that much. Yeah. I don't think. But anyways, let's move on. So, uh, Dan, value. The, the bus garage might not. Dan, Dan, this is like 23 minutes. That's good. <laughs> We're arguing um, about the value. The I'm going to no. give it an eight because I know because it's relatively affordable. It's 17, 18 bucks, but it is four feet, so it's not huge, and it's not themed. But but you kind of, in a sense, get three inflatables for the price of one because you have the, the scarecrow, you get a pumpkin, and then most importantly. You get a burdo. And how oh, many inflatables do we have up there? So, uh, value, it's already terrible. For five, oh, that's a shot against it. We're not doing that's bad. 19 then, for price. But then that's like $9.05 at half off. That's $17 at half off. That's where you really start to see the problem, especially with this style reveal. It's cool. That should be its full, I'm at full 30 price value. Total. It's like 20, then so five. I gotta give it like a. You know what? I'm feeling generous today. You do get quite a bit. A lot of people buy stuff at full fare. Licensed and playables are just the same. This one's not generally sure. Why not? Seven. So you get a 26. <laughs> That's such a cool piece to have. It, so you're at a 26, I'm at a 30. I think my number's more fair. You're just uh, being. No. You take off too much for being small. That's so. Uh, no, actually, small, is short actually smallness is not the thing's problem. It's biggest flaw. A happened to cut that. B, what in the fuck is that? That's a small thing. That is 
That's not a good small fan. Those things die so easily. That those fans, what give those fans bad reputations? All right. So Ben giving it a bad score because he's got a crappy fan and it was, and it had to be. That's what really ruins cheap fans. That's my opinion. Not right. lost to make Jemmy Cheap fans seem so bad when Jemmy Cheap fans aren't that bad. All right, with that being said. Excuse me? Well, I'm trying to That is a... my line. I have Two a... reviews in a row. Still have to. I'm just. The, the display I'm just, dominance as the camera I'm just, shakes as I beat the shit I'm out. just warning you that Guess your viewers aren't going to Guess what? If you made it right. to the end, we've got some. Um, what's it called? <laughs> If you made it this long, if you've listened to Ben I've been recording this long, then you need to subscribe. And not only should you subscribe, at the end but time. tell all of your These friends your and reminder. family to subscribe. And Shut all the people you don't know. Shut the hell up about wanting subscribers. Well, we hell? all know why you want We all know why you want them. Well, that's what everybody else on YouTube goes. Hey, you need to smash the like button and subscribe, 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 dude. Yeah, so like, we're we, we, we like trying to be less dicks about it, despite Rob wanting that monetization. <laughs> Uh, I housekeeping. I don't know. Colossal Christmas in November. Be excited. Anyway. We'll do the Nutcracker. We'll re-review the Nutcracker. We'll do the 20-foot Santa. The 20-foot Snowman. The 20-foot Christmas tree. The present stack. That's a, the Mega Candy Cane or Twig Tunnel. And last but not least, in the Colossal Christmas one, the, the main event is the 20 and a half foot Snowman family. If you want to see the 500 What about the Archways? I said Mega Candy Cane Archways Tunnels. Oh. If you want to see the $500 tunnel, comment below. We'll buy it at half off if it's still there. Maybe. Maybe not. Cause it's That's still $20. Are you crazy? Maybe not. I don't know. And plus, it's kind of small. We should buy it. Come on, we'll do a review and then take it back so we didn't like the it. The 20-foot <laughs> elf, I will be buying at half off. Because $100 for a console, I'm not bad at all. Oh, at half off. Yeah, if it's and there, the new it snowman. Is, it's not going to be there for half off. Uh, the only one we don't have is the 2022 reindeer. Yeah, if you so, have a 2022 reindeer, please send it our way for free. <laughs> I might pay 150 bucks. He will not pay anything for it. We want it for free. Yeah, actually, if you want to donate something, our PO address is... No. We should you get don't a even PO have a address. PO address. We should get one just PO, so people can PO, send PO it. PO box <laughs> inflatable display at 13. Wait, that's not a we should box. We should get a PO box. And then, Nobody's going to send you stuff. Are you crazy? They don't, you don't, you don't, hardly anyone even watches our videos. 2.2k hardly... views on Colossal Jack Skellington. 1. Point something k, 3.1k. Rob clearly needs to do his There's research. Like, uh, With all that being said, the housekeeping's complete. If we have millions and millions of videos Shut views, then I'll, I'll, I'll... I don't know how... Them. We're going to... We're going to be leading the inflatable community if we have millions and millions of views. With all that being said, housekeeping's done. Uh, everyone behind the inflatable displays for Tina would like to say thanks for watching if you made it to the end. Whole 28 minutes. Two fucking four foot cheap fans. Yeah, One's three well. and a half foot. Everyone would like to say thanks for watching. And of course, as always, bye for now.